I decided to put this post up because of a comment, I think it was like a week or two ago. And so a guy wrote a comment that um, girls in the comment section, you're always writing God win, God win, but you're not serious because every time I try to talk to one of these girls, like they end up not being serious, they don't want a relationship with me. So clearly they're just writing this God win, but they are not serious. Like it's not that they're not serious. You have to add the, this, the phrase with you. You have to add that at the end of any kind of rejection thing that you get. I think it will make you understand a bit better. So when these people are saying God when, guys, girls, anybody, when they're saying God when, they legit want a relationship. You know, when a guy is like, I want a relationship, I'm single. When a girl is like, I want a relationship, I'm single. It doesn't necessarily mean, it's not a first come, first serve basis. So it's not like, okay, the first girl that slides into my DM, I'll get married to her. The first guy that slides into my DM, I'll get married to him. God when, I'm single. God, I might spoon, all that. It doesn't mean they don't want a relationship. They do want a relationship, of course. And it's, it's Claire, stay dead there. But when you slide into their DM or you talk to them and they don't want one with you, you have to realize that it's with you. So when you kind of judge everybody and be like, um, all the people that are writing this, all the people doing this are not serious. They don't want a relationship. They're just pretending to want one. They're not pretending. They just don't want one with you. I know it's kind of, I mean, we're not jello fries. Everybody cannot like you, you know? So it's okay to kind of accept that. That not everybody will like me. So when I talk to a guy and I don't get the response, I hoped for and I wanted rather than say oh guys are not serious they're single that's why they end up staying single forever no it's just okay to understand that that person is not into you it's not that deep because some people really do take it personal so, you know on the platform some people are just being polite or trying to avoid confrontation you know so they might tell you I'm dating my last match even though that's not the truth you know or they'll tell you um yeah I just want to take a break from dating right now even though that's not the truth but they just don't know how to tell you that they're not interested in you. So if you meet like two, three girls and all of them don't want a relationship with you, or you meet two, three guys, they don't want a relationship with you, rather than just tag everybody like, oh, everybody's so unserious, they keep shouting that they're single, but when I come for a relationship, they don't want me. It's not an automatic thing. You know, it also takes, um, it also helps to take a step back and think, okay, especially when the numbers increase and ask yourself, okay, I've talked to five guys and I've gone on five dates within a month. How come none of these five guys kind of, you know, wanted to have a second date with me? It helps to kind of take a step back and look at it. It might be something simple, something you might be missing. So it might sound harsh, but it's not harsh because you're not jello fries. Everybody cannot love you. Even in small jobs, everyone has their favorites. So if people are not interested in you, even though they're shouting at the top of their lungs that they're single, it's okay. It's, it, I mean, it might hurt, but it's okay. So this message out there, because I'm tired of seeing in the comment section, people attacking people basically for saying things like I'm single or God win or stuff like that, you know, or even on platforms, even in the VIP membership saying, oh, this girl isn't serious or this guy isn't serious. I'm not sure he's ready to be in a relationship. I promise you, give him the right person and he will be in a relationship. You know, saying like, oh, this lady, I'm not sure she's ready to be in a relationship. She's still acting like this, this, that. Give her the right person that should be ready to be in a relationship. So, you know, it's like one of those situations where you see someone that you feel like they just broke up like last week and then they get married to someone. Meanwhile, they dated someone for years, but then they meet someone in a week and they've proposed. And you're like, how? It's just, it, I mean, people would do stuff for the right person or for the person that they want to be with. So instead of getting mad and vexed, you know, when someone isn't doing or acting the way you want them to, just realize it's not really about you. They're just not interested in you in that way. So like I told a lady last week, to find a spouse is not hard. Literally just go outside and shout, I want a husband or I want a wife and I'll pay this amount. Literally, it's not that hard to find a spouse. But finding the type of spouse you want, that's where the tricky part comes in. So that's why even when you see people shouting, God, when, this, when, that's when, I'm single, God help me, they still have a type. Everyone has a type. So you have to understand that it's nothing personal if that person is not interested in you in that way you know basically they're still looking out for the person that they want that fits the idea of the person that they want to be with